Hello and welcome to the third battle of the final of the Winter Cup from Napoleon Total War. Here the Unity team faces again Artus and me. So the Unity team consisting of uh, Philip here with Portugal and Lancer here with Great Britain. We have Great Britain and Spain. And yeah, the map is Amazon Confluence. They picked it, so they are the defenders. And we have uh, to yeah, kill their armies or um, yeah, get them out of the middle here. So this is a hill which is in the winning zone and also this forest. So let's start. We have uh, worse nations um, with Spain here against Portugal uh, because we already used our light infantry nations um, like two of them, Portugal and Prussia on pyramids. So we have, uh, yeah, the odds are against us. <laughs> but we will see. Uh, we had also Austria and France left, but uh, regarding possible uh, more games, we wanted to um, yeah, save us some good nations. So the strategy for, for, for attacker side here is uh, to basically attack on the left, because the right you see is quite hard. There's a hill in front of you where the uh, other uh, uh, player already sits on and this is quite tough to uh, storm. So uh, you have a bit of a better position here on the left. So I have Great Britain with my uh, army which I made for this tournament with four lights. Uh, Two of them from the Queen's German Legion, a lot of foot infantry, two guards, one of them are, is the Coltstein Guard, uh, two Highlanders and two cavalry and one's fanciable unit. Artos plays four cavalry, four lights uh, and yeah, two Walloon Guards and the six star general and a lot of fusiliers. Some of them are leveled up, also the light infantry. Lancer did something uh, smart here. He sent some units here to this island as well. Uh, people did not. Uh, yeah, the overall this map is not that common. Um, so yeah, actually till this year nobody played it uh, really in the um, yeah competitive multiplayer scene. So uh, there yeah are some more things people can try out like uh, for, uh, as you can see Lancer did in this game uh, to yeah back up this f his units in this forest he also sent some units uh, to this island and yeah places uh, his um, light infantry here to shoot over the river to counter this I should have uh, had uh, some units and uh, here like here on the island as well but for the moment I don't have and uh, he I see that he has some fencibles in the front row and I have a very good position here so I will engage them he has his King's German Legion light foot already but uh, yeah my light foot infantry is here on the hill as well here nice shots from on the fencibles and I retreat, he deploys his light infantry and he is shooting but he shot the hill and I can approach, he shoots uh, unfortunately uh, with, uh, he sh for me he shoots with the second one but now he retreated and uh, while they are running they are losing more. I'm approaching here with the fencibles. They shot the hill and 
I sh shoot the hill as well. Nice. The poor hill is definitely dead. And um, we uh, were in fear that they might uh, yeah, attack this forest with their superior forces uh, from this hill, which is uh, quite a good opportunity. Um, so we uh, decided to play um, very defensive on the right and yeah, place the main core of Arthur's army here on this hill so we are not in danger to uh, lose a lot of men if they attack this position so Portuguese Cazadores up on the hill this shoot devastating volleys into the light infantry they are down to 56 very nice micro here from the Cazadores from Philip I open fire on the light foot but I do not kill much uh, because they are inside the forest light foot has a very uh, Light infantry has a very nice position here and nice volley here from Athos on the Cazadores, uh, which also made them run away here. Um, Lancer has some uh, nice unit, which you not, uh, do not see that often. It's the Tenth Hussars. It's a uh, yeah sniper unit um, on horseback. <laughs> So I shoot a cuff of sniper range with 100, 125, but they are uh, very inaccurate and yeah, normally they do not pay off. But nice idea to bring some uh, additional kind of light infantry unit for this position here, where he can, uh, as you can see, aim at my troops if I attack this forest. I got a bit uh, catched off guard from the movement uh, he made with his troops here, foot guards and King's German Legion and this cavalry on this island. Um, but, and I did not really react to this as I said uh, in a good way. I just um, attacked the forest as I wanted to, as I planned to. So. I gave target orders here, I have a better position. He fires with the second Kicks German Legion here as well, but I th saw it, I think, and will give a target order in a second as well. I sent two foot infantry to uh, push away the fencibles and the lights and get a foothold in the forest. I fire one volley and then I go into melee. For the moment I'm shooting above the heads of my uh, foot infantry here. I charge the fencibles to get rid of them very fast. I hoped they lose plenty of men here in my attack. Over here it's quiet now. Philip deployed uh, a lot of units already in the forest and uh, you see that Lancer has most of his uh, units here in the fight while I only have two of my foot infantry and my light infantry in the fight, I also uh, do not have my infantry deployed in a very good way to protect my light, uh, light infantry if he counterattacks. But over here I um, char also charged the King's German Legion foot. I got a good charge on them and they lo lost plenty of men already. I uh, give target orders on them to support my unit here. He doesn't shoot with his foot infantry behind. I have my general very close to the action. And I also charge the stationary foot infantry over here. And while I'm fighting with my foot infantry I still target the light infantry but he comes with his first cavalry, the Light Dragoons. 
I target them with my light infantry while my reinforcements of foot guards and Thailand of foot are approaching. He, um, I also uh, shot the light infantry over here, but now I went a bit too far and got shot by the Cazadores. The light dragoons are uh, got shot down, and I charge again at the foot infantry. quite good charge here and the light dragoons are running My but here come the comes a foot infantry up the hill I thought he actually melee charges us and got panicked here uh, while he also attacked with light dragoons here and uh, as I said my positioning of units on the left of my line infantry uh, is very bad. Actually, it's not. They are not existing uh, here on the far left. So this is a brilliant moment for a light dragoon attack here from Lancer, and he does it uh, and also back charges my double line of foot guards and highlanders. Um, so a brilliant tactical move by Lancer at this point. Here comes this uh, Portuguese militia, but they are behind the hill. I'm targeting the Light Dragoons, but I suffered plenty of casualties uh, on my foot guards and highlanders here and re uh, decided to retreat them. While I saw that he shot with the foot infantry over here, so I wanted to shoot them as well, but he retreated them in time. Over here, Atos got some shots off on the Cazadores. Nice. Uh, they suffered plenty of casualties here. So Atos uh, managed to gain some uh, advantage back, or not about advantage, but uh, um, he definitely killed more in the second shootout than he did um, lose before. Over here he got, unfortunately, he got shot from the Cazadores. And I'm uh, sending my second wave into the into the forest. Well, the tenth of Fusas, I think they shot like two volleys already. And I try to uh, help Atos here in the middle against the line, uh, Portuguese line infantry, and I send a, another double line here. Well, I'm still targeting with my light infantry. I saw that Atos has some light infantry in a very good position here. So I retreated my li line infantry again. And here I got uh, very good shots off on uh, Lance's light infantry, which had a very bad position. Tenth of Hussas have a line of sight on my uh, line infantry, but there is a hill uh, which protects me a little. And I bring up my first cavalry. The Cazadores have a much superior position, but some of their shots also hit uh, the hill. So I'm trying to. Uh, mess up the f British formation here from Lancer and kill some of the smaller units. Actually I hope that uh, I will get to the light infantry here but he target shoots with all of his units in the area which are not in square and my light dragoons are out of men very fast. 
but Atos uh, managed to get some very good shots off here on the line infantry, which is retreating now. And Philip moves some units here down from the hill, but overall he doesn't do much. He is very defensive because they only have to hold this this area. They don't have to do anything uh, offensive. The second foot guard uh, here from Lancer, apart from the Coldstream guards, engaged my line infantry. And I'm getting flank fire into my ranks here from the forest. And send some more troops into the fight. I hope that he might uh, come back with his line infantry, but uh, he ran away and um, wanted to use the Portuguese uh, support units here from the forest. So I sent my foot guards into the forest. Uh, on the left, and my situation here in the forest is very bad. He, as I said, he had much more units in the fight compared to me, and my position is very bad. He has more space to deploy uh, with his strategy of uh, holding this uh, other island and the crossing. Philip now uh, did engage Athos here and managed to uh, yeah, get into the forest, and Atos uh, fights a retreating, uh, a fighting retreat here. And s uh, sits here on the second uh, hill, which was our plan, since he cannot fight, uh, I mean he cannot win against the Portuguese army with Spain. I charge downhill with my small line infantry. That's how they uh, can still do some damage. And you see, they, the Portuguese line suffered quite some damage. But overall, our situation is very bad. Uh, I failed with my uh, first and also my second attack on this forest. I killed a lot of uh, Lance's forces and uh, I think I also have more troops uh, st uh, like healthy lines in, um, which did not engage in the fight yet but the problem is that uh, our strategy kind of counted on uh, me doing uh, very much damage obviously because uh, Spain can't do so much damage in such a scenario. Against Portugal so uh, we are in trouble so I have to do something decisive here on the left before we can actually push this forest. This is the problem. Atos still has his uh, Walloon guards, both of them in full numbers, and also three, four cavalry, all his four cavalry, so that's very good for us. I sent my uh, smaller Highlander foot here, which engaged in my first attack on this forest. And Philip garrisons this forest here with his uh, troops. And I want to shoot a volley on the foot infantry here. But I get a volley into my ranks.
Here I saw that his uh, backup line shot already and thought that we might, and he has no backup here anymore, so I uh, thought we can do a combined attack with Artis Cavalry here with my Coldstream Guards on this infantry, but they got shot down already pretty, pretty far. They got targeted over here already. But um, his line is in square now, and I first charge at the Portuguese over here with my Highlanders and manage to break them. So I charge the next unit over here. The Portuguese are not that good in melee as the British are, so I, uh, it's better to charge to use the Highlanders against the Portuguese than against the British. And the first Valungat supports my Highlanders here. And I charge downhill at the next unit, which uh, is redeploying. And Lancer uh, is shooting at my very spread out light infantry on the hill. Uh, this is what I want him to do because I'm out of ammunition and um, he spends ammunition on them, so that's better than just charging them uh, in melee, where they will not do much damage. Over here, um, unfortunately, uh, the Walloon Guards are under attack from the Cazadores here on range. Uh, but overall, the situation is more or less stable here. And Lancer decided to uh, for a an attack on my position, but uh, seeing my unit movements, he decided against it again and retreated into his forest. And I. Uh, sent my reserve light infantry, which I forgot for the last five minutes, uh, here to the good position, and target his line infantry. The Walloon Guards are down to 61, and are kind of exposed to enemy fire. And I saw that, uh, yeah, would be a good time to push here uh, between them. So uh, Atos uh, made a melee charge with his Walloon guards on the retreating Portuguese line infantry and followed this man move with his Fusiliers, while Lancer does not really have the numbers here anymore uh, of foot infantry to um, close the gap. We have some, some more foot guard unit here, but uh, I have my, my light infantry threatens the direct way here. Here, nice melee from, from the Walloon guards. But of course, with the Spanish Fusiliers and only one foot infantry unit from me. We don't have the firepower to actually uh, do a lot of damage here in the in the wood. And the tenth has crossed the uh, river again, and. Lancer sent some support units to Philip since they uh, were in threat of getting uh, yeah, attacked more in this forest. So I decided for a third push on this on this forest, which he just uh, left again. And 
gave attack orders on the Coldstream Guards here with the Highlanders. I uh, double line with my Coldstream Guards and sent my second line infantry here. He moves back his units and I go a bit closer since this line is not getting shot till this moment. Nice melee charge here from the Fusiliers against the Portuguese. But overall uh, we have to do something decisive over here. I hope that the Lancers will uh, counter charge the 10th Hussars, but um, they were too far away and got stuck here on the on the infantry. And again uh, Lancer did a very good uh, cavalry attack here on my light infantry uh, and also the Spanish Fusiliers here in the back. The next Lancero is getting uh, shot down here but I get back into the into the forest. But um, Philip managed to take as uh, to get some units here on the hill and has a very good position here behind the edge of the hill now with a line of sight on the Spanish. We only have the second Valoon guard which is uh, capable of doing something against the Portuguese. Over here my Coldstream Guard foot infantry double line um, tries to kill the foot guards and Coldstream Guards and I sent my second cavalry and counter charged the 10th of Hussars. I won the charge uh, downhill and formed a square with the Highlanders. I got focused uh, once again but I made it with my cavalry into the forest and tried to kill the small units. Athos helps me with his and very nice micro here from Athos. Uh, great cavalry, he broke the square from the Portuguese which was f f uh, formed late but the Casadores unfortunately uh, got a good volley on the Lanceros. I tried to de make uh, more damage with my Light Dragoons and um, f uh, finish off Lancer who retreats with the remnants of his army. I got a charge on his general here but uh, he survived and I got another charge here on the foot infantry. But the Portuguese cavalry is coming two of them and I don't have any back lines obviously anymore and L Lancer made it he ran away before I c could destroy his force completely so now I have the forest but we don't have the numbers anymore to uh, yeah kill Portugal and Nice cavalry here from Philip. He destroys our remnants on the hill. And I send back my uh, troops. I have to form squares here. Nice volley here from the Fusiliers on the line infantry of Portugal. And the Walloon backs up uh, Arthur's formation. Philip's cavalry is out, but the second one is over here, and the tenth of Fusus are still um, around with 14 men. Again, nice ball here from the Fusiliers. They have a, a good position. But you see the Portuguese cavalry is approaching, and Philip is uh, concentrating all his firepower against the Walloon Guard. I hope to shoot the, uh, the Portuguese cavalry with my Highlander foot. 
and I did hide a line of uh, infantry here in the forest uh, and Lancer came back with his small units from two sides he is out of ammunition obviously and charges with all his units also his tens of Fusa so I form a square while I'm still firing with the with the cold stream guards and I try to uh, charge with my highlanders against the Portuguese but he's concentrating his fire and um, I lost a lot of men on my way and only the Walloons are still alive here my square held against the cavalry and the uh, foot infantry and my costume guard is also out of ammunition so we also lost the third game they won 3-0 uh, against us so a uh, good game to them well played I think this was uh, quite a good um, last game for this match so Philip and Lancer the yeah, main unity team won the tournament the Napoleon Total War Winter Cup thanks for organizing the tournament to um, yeah, all the administrators mainly Philip and Lancer was very uh, interesting to play with those uh, new winning zones and uh, thinking about some maps and strategies uh, once again thank you uh, th thank you also thank you also to all, all the other participants um, of the tournament it was nice that uh, eight teams got together and uh, yeah played most of the tournament unfortunately some of them left before but that always happens so the uh, end screen of course is uh, very bad for Artus here for Spain but that was uh, I mean uh, as I said uh, it was predictable the, the Spanish don't have a chance in a shootout against Portugal and the Casadores had a very uh, good position actually and, uh, by far better so Atos strongly relied on me uh, here in this battle to actually do a lot of damage and uh, still have enough uh, left to uh, f also fight Portugal together with him and also of course to finish Lancer much faster I did manage uh, with a bit of uh, uh, yeah, cavalry help from Atos. Uh, I finally managed to uh, kill Lancer, or more or less kill him. Um, I made him retreat, but yeah, it was obviously not uh, very well done by me, and um, I did not kill enough for our strategy to uh, work out in this game. So, very n uh, nice pick by them, very good uh, nation play uh, with the matchup uh, so they still had those two good nations for this map left my guards did quite a good job my cavalry did very bad and the second highland of foot as well I think it was the second one I used here um, which got shot down pretty heavily so thank you all for watch uh, for watching the tournament series and I wish you a very good time and see you in the next video bye